KS Services is now offering preventative maintenance plans as low as $12 a month. Preventative maintenance is so important when it comes to your HVAC system. Let us come check your system out and perform our 22-point inspection. It's better to be safe than sorry. We have so many plans to choose from and special offers that go along with them. Call today for more information. 205-322-9090, Alabama license number 11120. Good Saturday morning. This is your Weather Extreme video for January 5th, 2019. I am meteorologist Scott Martin. While we have now entered the beginning of a period of drier weather for a while in central Alabama, we will have to put up with Old Man Winter as he brings us colder air starting next week. We'll get to that in a minute or two. Temperatures at 640 this morning are in the upper 30s to the mid 40s across central Alabama. The warm spot is down in Troy at 46 degrees, while the cool spot is Haleyville at 37 degrees. Birmingham, Tuscaloosa, Gadsden, and Anniston are all tied at 39 degrees. We are starting off the day with clear skies across much of central Alabama, but we do have some pesky clouds lingering over the southeastern parts of the area, but those should be out of here in a couple of hours or so. Now taking a look at the 060 run of the GFS valid today at noon, with the troughing now moving to the east of us and ridging starting to build out to our west, we'll have a very nice day across the area with moderating temperatures. Afternoon highs will top out in the mid-50s to the lower 60s, a little warmer than normal for the early parts of January. We'll have mainly clear skies continue through the evening and overnight hours with lows dropping into the mid-30s to the lower 40s. As the ridging to our west moves even closer to central Alabama, our weather will continue to be very nice with temperatures entering the mild category. We'll have a good bit of sunshine with only a few passing clouds with afternoon highs in the lower 60s to near 70 degrees across the area from north to south. We'll have a few more clouds move in late in the evening, giving us partly cloudy skies by the overnight hours and lows dipping into the lower 40s across the area. By Monday afternoon, the apex of the ridge will have passed through central Alabama and the flow starts to become more zonal behind it. There will also be a low moving up into the Great Lakes area which will be trailing a cold front that will eventually move through central Alabama on late Monday evening and into the early morning hours on Tuesday. While the latest model runs have trended drier, there may be just enough moisture to include a very small chance of a few sprinkles or very light showers across the northern half of the area for Monday evening through the pre-dawn hours on Tuesday morning. Skies will become mostly cloudy with highs in the 60s on Monday and skies beginning to clear late on Tuesday with highs also in the 60s. If you are interested in the weather for the national championship game, number one Alabama will be taking on number two Clemson out in Santa Clara, California, with kickoff taking place at 7 p.m. Central Standard Time. At this point, the game looks to be taking place in between rounds of showers. There is a chance of a few showers during the day prior to kickoff, but those should come to an end before the coin toss. Skies, skies will be mostly cloudy throughout the game, and there may be a passing shower, but for now it looks to be dry. Temperatures will be in the 50s throughout the game. The ridging begins to build again out to our west, and that will bring us another few days of dry but cooler weather across central Alabama. Wednesday will feature a good bit of sunshine with just a few clouds and highs in the upper 40s to the mid 50s across the area from north to south. There will even be more sunshine on Thursday, but highs will remain cool, also topping out in the upper 40s to the mid-50s. The ridging flattens out again as the pattern goes zonal, and there will be a small impulse that will begin to make its way towards central Alabama on Friday. We'll have clouds begin to build in during the morning and afternoon hours, and we'll have a very small chance of a few passing showers during the late afternoon and through the remainder of the day. Afternoon highs will be in the upper 40s to the mid 50s across the area from north to south. Now taking a look out in Voodoo Land, while we look to stay dry for a good while with only a few chances of passing light showers here and there, the next decent chance of rain doesn't look to be in here until the evening hours of Sunday, January 20th. According to the GFS outlook on temperatures, 
It looks like Old Man Winter is here to stay for a while once the front moves through on Tuesday as highs look to stay in the 40s for the most part through the 14th with lows in the 30s and 40s. The GFS is also showing around one quarter of an inch of rain between now and the 14th. But this can and will change as this is out in voodoo land. That is all for your Saturday edition of the Weather Extreme video. We'll have notes on the blog throughout the day. Bill Murray will have your next video for you on Sunday morning. I'm meteorologist Scott Martin signing off. Enjoy the beautiful weekend while we have the warmer weather. Have a great day and God bless. Thank you.